might seem like basketball wives have it all. <laughs> Behind the bling, we deal with all types of things, from groupies, cheating, loneliness. Although our lives are all over the place and crazy, I think it's really important that we stick together and make it through as a team. I'm Shawnee O'Neal, and for the past seven years, I've been married to one of the biggest names in basketball, Shaquille O'Neal. But now, I filed for divorce. My name is Evelyn Lozada. I'm 34 years old, and I'm from the Boogie Down Bronx. Hello. The reason why I moved to Miami is because my ex-fiance was playing for Miami. We were together for a little over 10 years. I'm excited to move on with my life. Eventually, you know, I want to be able to find somebody that's right for me. But right now, at the moment, I'm okay dating. My name is Gloria. My fiance is Matt Barnes, and he's a professional basketball player. And I think we kind of have our stuff together. I have almost what they don't have. It's frustrating for them to see that. Who has slept with Shaquille O'Neal? Allegedly, her sister. It is no one else's business. I will defend my sister with every last fucking breath in my body, and if anybody else has a question about it, then you can come have see me about, about it. I have talked to Shawnee about it. My name is Royce Lindsay Reed. I am 29 years old. I was a dancer for Miami and Orlando. I think there's a misconception about me that I'm a gold digger. I know Shawnee has told me that she wants us all to get along but I kind of feel like it's turned into a pick on Royce type moment. She's crazy. My name is Jennifer Williams. I am 34 years old. My husband is Eric Williams. There are definitely some great perks being married to a basketball player. Good evening, Mr. Williams. Hey, how you doing, buddy? You go to some amazing restaurants, you travel first class, but this whole lifestyle is dysfunctional. I got some things I gotta get to. Whatever things means, <laughs> who knows? I think once you have experienced infidelity, you have a different take on relationships and athletes. And it does make it difficult to, to trust these guys, for sure. We need some shots right away. Susie is one of my girlfriends, and she was in a relationship with for 10 years. I'm a pro, I'm a pro. Susie knows damn near everybody. She's my Facebook buddy. She's like the queen of Miami. Cheers to getting this. <laughs> going out with her, it's never going to be a dull moment. Look at the girls, look at the girls. Oh, as we proceed, yeah. oh shit. Wow. Oh. oh my god. I don't uh <gasps> What are you doing? It looks bad. Open your ears and hear what I hear. I'm a bad mother. I'm a bad mother because I have nannies. Miami definitely has its fair share of groupies. It can get very interesting at times. Do something. That's why I said sit the fuck okay. down. Okay. I will fucking do something, bitch. Oh, It's about time some shit like this happens because these bitches don't care. I'm just glad that you guys all can call each other friends. Amen. <laughs> Everybody needs somebody.